I am speed. One winner, four losers. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Ladies and gentle cars, welcome to the Radiator Springs Grand Prix. And boy, it's going to be a humdinger of a race, too. <laughs> Check out them fancy racing outfits. Yep, we got some familiar faces. And some new guys, too. I say, lovely day to rip it up on a small town track, eh? And of course, we got my best friend here, too. Radiator Springs' own most famous race car, Mr. Lightning McQueen. So let's get this show on the road. Lightning? Are you in there? Lightning! Check her flag. Lightning, wake up! Oh, what, did, I, did I win? I think you were dreaming. Oh. Yeah, I was dreaming about a race. You know, I kind of figured that. No, it wasn't any ordinary race. It was the Radiator Springs Grand Prix. And you were in it. And Doc. And Mater was the announcer. You know what that sounds like to me? What? Sounds like you're ready for some competition. Oh, you got that right. Well, today's a great day for it. Doc's looking for you. He wants you to meet him out at Willie's Butte later. And I saw some new cars hanging out at Flo's. Maybe fans of yours looking for a race. Wow, sounds like I better get busy. Hey, kid. You ready to go after the Piston Cup? Yeah, showtime. Well, you said it. Just as soon as you get some practice. Well, you've been taking it kind of easy around town for a while now, so we got to get you back into shape before the new season starts. Besides, they just don't let anybody with four wheels race for the Piston Cup, you know. First, you've got to place in enough races, games, and competitions to qualify. Then you can go back to the big leagues, all right? So what do you say? You ready to get moving? ka -chow. I'll take that as an okie dokie. Ah, you're the esteemed American racer, Lightning McQueen, correct? Um, okay. Splendid! How fortuitous! And my colleague Gerald and I were hoping to engage your attention in a little competitive excursion. Was that English? British, my dear boy. We've hopped across the pond to give you Yanks 1 4, eh? What about you guys? We have also come for a challenge. All right then, welcome. The more the merrier. Let's go tractor tipping. Wait a minute, you wanna go tractor tipping? <laughs> Please, I thought you was a scared. Me? Afraid of tractors? No, was scared of Frank. Nah, Frank's a big guy, moves slow. Well, I've seen him move pretty fast. He moves left, I'll fake to the right. He cuts to the right, I shoot to the left. Well, all right then, smarty fenders. What if he comes straight at us? Easy, we run. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Hey, stickers. I was hoping you and I could oh go. Oh my gosh! Well. There he is! It's totally him! Hi, Lightning. Remember us? Of course, are you kidding? Who could forget? Uh, yeah, you know, I think you look familiar. <laughs> he remembers us! So, aren't you going to introduce me to your friends? 
Yeah, this is, uh... I'm Mia. I'm Tia. We're his biggest fans. Okay. Wow. Well, that's charming. We were hoping, like, Lightning would take a drive with us. Actually, ladies, I don't think that's such a good idea. Ho hold on, hold on. I, I, I have a better idea. You girls up for a little friendly competition? Three laps. Winner takes a drive with Lightning. Oh, my gosh! We're so in! You don't have to do this. Uh, don't you worry. I need the workout. Count me in, too, honey. Can't have a girl's day without me. So how'd it go? Piece of cake. Really? <laughs> Come on. Groupies are no match for the real thing. So what about that drive? You've got yourself a date. You're late, son. Been waiting here an hour already. Sorry. Yeah, well, time's a waste and let's get to work. Come on, Doc. I still got it. So you say. You still remember how to handle yourself on dirt? Sure, sure, right to go left, and this time, I'm not going into the cactus, old-timer. Well, we'll just see about that. Whew! Good run! Uh-huh. Not bad. That track's only got two turns, though. Let's see how you handle these back roads. You and me. What, me? Racing the fabulous Hudson Hornet? Nope. You racing your crew chief. Let's go. How's that? Okay? Ah, that's okay, but you're hanging it out too much. Too early on the throttle. Hey, you listening to me? Whoa, what's he doing here? Checking out the competition. Yeah, must be nervous. No, just smart. Huh, you think I should do the same thing to him? Go to his town, hide out, watch him practice? You race. As well as you run your mouth, you'd have that piston cup already. Just don't worry about him. You have plenty of work to do. I'm sure you'll be seeing each other soon. Hey, Lizzie, what you got there? Oh, postcards. Old ones, too. I've been collecting these for a long time, from all the way down Route 66. Wow. Oh, look at that one. Some of these go back 60 years. <gasps> It's a blizzard! Don't worry, Lizzie, I'll find them. They can't have gone too far. Hey, Lightning! You ready for your first big race of the season? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm pumped. Speaking of pumps, if Flo pumps me full of any more fuel, I think I'm gonna bust my trailer hitch. Better hit the road! <laughs> Daryl Car Trip here at Palm Mile Speedway for the start of what's going to be an amazing Piston Cup race season. Last season's Piston Cup saw perennial loser Chick finally take first place. But it could have been last place as far as the fans were concerned. This season, all eyes are on Lightning McQueen. And I got to tell you, after his incredible display of sportsmanship, I know a lot of y'all are going to be rooting for him. With the King retired, it's going to be Chick versus Lightning this time around. Chick ain't gonna give up that trophy so easily either. Lightning McQueen, buddy, you better watch your back. Hey, Guido, all set? Feet stop, boss. Uh -oh. Lightning. Ah, hello, Chick. Check it out. E fai attenzione. So, big deal. Well, you know. 
I just figured you might want to get acquainted with the view. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know, because you're going to be spending a lot of time behind me. In the race. We're going to be in the race, and I'll be ahead of you and a little bit behind me. In the race! Is it me? Is it not, what are they not getting here? <laughs> you are so driven, Chick. I love that about you. Hey, you! Back to your pit. Stop bugging my driver. Too bad your crew chief isn't going to be out on the track to look after his little boy. Oh, excuse me. Hey, cosa ti prende? of special brew, my friend. Whoa, Fillmore, what's in there? Good stuff, huh? I call it my super octane boost juice. You think it'll help me go faster? <laughs> Only one way to find out, man. So, right to go left, right? Uh, yeah. Whoa, deep. Well, I think you'll get more out of this than me. So here, fill up on this batch and I'll just keep brewing it for you. Free of charge. Really? Thanks. You need a new tire, yes? No, but I think someone might. Who? I will sell to them some beautiful white walls. Well, I've seen a lot of hubcaps and tires lying by the side of the road outside of town. Tires? On the ground? Do you want me to have Mater pick them up for you? No, 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 no. no. Luigi will do it himself. My poor tires, abandoned, alone, dirty. Luigi will go save them. Dreadfully garish, aren't they? Positively gilded. Too true. They are loving my gold. Now, why gold, my dear boy? This is all about winning. You cannot take first place if you do not look the part. Oh, and how do you know you can best us in the next competition? Easy. I see you have silver on your rims. He's got a point there. scheduled to be here at 0100, soldier. <laughs> Sarge, I'm not really a soldier. You are now, Private. Ten yes, sir. I can't hear you, McQueen. Yes, sir. Better. Now, Doc said you are sorely in need of some formal off-road training. And by the looks of you, I'd say he's right. You're in my army now, son. So get down on your wheels and kiss the asphalt goodbye. Let's move it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> this is oh too my. hard! Come on, you gas guzzling sissies! I know you all got V8s! <laughs> I didn't get my latte! Have you ever even been off road? I want you to wade into that mud! Eat that dirt! Now, your first task is to make it around this course. Double time, and clear all obstacles. Do not falter! Failure is not an option. No faltering. Check. Not bad. But now the course is different. 
It will require different skills. You will need to be agile, fit, athletic, and adaptable. <laughs> You've been reading my press, haven't you, Sarge? Although you left out sleek, charming, and dashing. Okay, I'm going. All right. One last test. And it'll require all of your muscle, all of your cunning. I want horsepower. I want focus. I want ingenuity, agility, and endurance. Ah, uh, I want some coolant. Move it! You look overheated, Private McQueen. Yes. Exhausted. Yes. You'd like nothing better than a hot car wash, a cool ration of fuel, and a nice shady garage. Oh, yes, please. Well, too bad. We're gonna go for a little drive. We've got a race to get to. Piston Cup, here we come! world's best backwards driver. You seen him around? Do you think he has time to give me that backwards driving lesson he promised? You bet your ding-dang bumper I do. <clears throat> there are certain rules when you are driving backwards. The first thing you gotta do is turn your rear tires like they was your fronts. Like this right here. Then once you're going a bit and you want to head left, all you're gonna need to do is turn right. Got it? Ah, oh, I think so. Right to go left. Now, where have I heard that before? Good race, Mater. Think I got the hang of it? You sure do, Mr. G Gint, Grunt, Gint, Gint, Mr. Ginnell. Ginnell? Mater, what's a Ginnell? It's your name backwards. Hello? Mater, my name's not Litnig. You're not so good with the whole spelling thing, are you? Keeping cool, Sheriff? Nope. Speeders. Yeah, I hate those little buggers, too. They get all stuck in your no, grill and... No, no, not mosquitoes, son. Speeders! Got sand in your tank or what? You of all cars should know a thing or two about speeding. Wasn't too long ago I recall catching a certain race car who tore through my town. Right. That chase. Well, you gotta remember, you had help. Help? You wouldn't accuse an officer of the law of cheating, would you, son? Well, there's some barbed wire snagged on my bumper, telephone wires, and that statue of Stanley kind of slowed me down, too. Why, you're trying to tempt me into a rematch, aren't you? Sheriff, no. But I do something like that. I'll take your challenge, boy. Doc just tuned me up and outfitted me with a turbocharger. Wait a second. You're not gonna bust me for speeding and throw me into the impound afterwards, are you? No, sir. Not if you win. What do you think you're doing, son? What? I thought all cops liked donuts. Get out of here before I have you picking up trash on the highway. Ah, come on. Give me a little laugh on that. The donuts? That's funny. Oh, yeah. 
hot rudder. <sighs> Maybe it's time to go see Doc again. Mater, you realize, of course, most cars do not do that on purpose. Well, I gotta practice for my race. I'm a real racing car now. The Rust Bucket Racerama, huh? Let me guess. Demolition Derby. Yep, it's my favorite racing track in the whole world. Well, it's a family tradition. Look, there's my cousin Tommy Joe right there. New guy! Ow! What, are you crazy? Ah, uh, he just done give you a hood, bud. That's Tommy Joe's way of saying hey. Howdy. I got an idea. Lightning, you want to help us practice for our big race? No, I think I'll sit this one out. Wow, Mater, I thought my races were rough. That was... You're missing a tooth. I am? No, oh, I didn't have no teeth there before. Hey, Lightning, I won you a present. Check this out. I know how you love this boosty stuff. Wow, thanks, Mater. Hey, look, you didn't have to take all that abuse just for me, you know. Abuse? That was fun. And besides... What are best friends for, anyway? Hey, you're that Lightning McQueen guy. Yeah, we're from Queens. Barry, be cool. So, anyways, uh, we got a uh, opportunity for you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You think you're the best race car around, but if you just want to be the best, first you got to beat the best. <laughs> and I take it that would be you guys. What, you don't believe us? Come on, tough guy. I will throw down, which is right here, right now. Yeah, throw down, down to the ground, on the road. Ow! Okay, guys, no problem. I accept your opportunity. Ready when you are, buddy. Ross got your back. He's got your back. All right, time for a checkup. Them new horses get your attention, don't it? Yeah, Doc, this new upgrade feels great. Well then, why don't you just show this crazy old grandpa car what you got? Hey, stickers. You ready for that drive you owe me? Wheel well? Sure. We haven't been up there in a while. Great. Just a nice leisurely drive, right? Oh, absolutely. Not even going to hit third gear. Ladies first. Okay, if you say so. <sighs> Remember the first time we came up here? Yeah, you mean the first time you tricked me into a race. <laughs> I did do that, didn't I? I'll never forget it. Guido, how come you not keep the tires from falling, eh? E non urlare a me! Mi hai sorpreso! Uh, Luigi, hello! Ah, hello, my friend. 
Hey, there are these guys in town that want to race me, and I'm going to need a new set of tires, so hit me. He wanted the white walls, no? No, Luigi, that's not going to cut it. I think I need something a little bigger. Get over here! I will flatten you like a pancake! You can't hide from us! <laughs> Oh, do I have the tires for you, Guido? Oh yeah, you have the tires. You're about to find out. Let's do this! Say the race is over. You can stop your yelling now. Oh yeah, right. Right, sorry. I find the American landscape so myriad in its challenges, don't you? Every turn a bracing new thrill, every distance a dangerous gauntlet. Don't you agree, my fellow racing aficionados? Uh, are we gonna race or what? Sorry, Chief. Road's closed. Looks okay to me. No, he means it's closed to you. What's that? I can't hear you. I said it's closed to you. Nope, still getting nothing. You said get lost, pal. Oh, what are you gonna slice and dice me with your spoiler? Hey, wait a... Tell you what, subwoofer. Three laps ought to settle this. Me, you, and your little tweeter friends. When I win, you let me pass. Oh, and you can throw in one of your boost canisters. Seriously, do you really need that much boost? Okay, let's do this. Okay, boost tank. Ah, come on, guys. Don't be so hard on yourselves. You know what? Just learn to relax. Go take a drive. This isn't over, McQueen. Let's bounce! Hey, look, guys. It's the king of the road. Yeah, more like McQueen of the road. Hey, Chickster. What are you doing out here, dog? I don't know. Thought I might try out a few things I've learned. Ah, you went back to school. Good for you, chick. Maybe you'll even graduate this time. Education is so important. He's right, you know. Ow! You know, I spend a lot of time in my hood, and you hit it. He hits my hood. Watch the hood, okay? Hey, Mr. Educator, you ready to get schooled? I forgot to tell you, Chick, the roads out here aren't like the tracks you and I are used to. No, they got these things called right turn. Hey, Terry, so what? It wasn't a real race anyway. Nobody was there to see it or watch us. Nobody was there, like a, you know, if a tree falls in the forest and nobody, you know, doesn't get hurt, does anybody see it? Or, you know, hear it? Oh, that's right, I forgot. You like losing in front of a crowd. See you at the stadium. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, I'll see you. If you ever make it there. What's that supposed to mean?
There he is. We all set? Oh, it's on. It's bedtime. Oh, that's nice. Sheriff, have you seen Mac? Oh, bad news, son. He just radioed. He was driving west along the interstate, and somehow a gang of punk kids stole all of your gear from his trailer. Is he okay? Sounded a bit shaken up. Probably feels bad about it more than anything. Oh, good. I'm glad he's all right. Oh, no. I need that stuff for my next race. Crazy delinquent hot rodders. Wait till I catch him. That's it. You can mess with me, but you don't mess with my friends. Oh man, you busted my subwoofer! And look at my spoiler! It's cracked! You're lucky that's all you got to complain about, son. We'll see what Doc Hudson has to say about this. Hey, it wasn't our idea. Yeah, some car paid us off. Some car? Yeah, some green race car. I don't know, he had a mustache. Ah, chick. Come on, I'm ready. Let's go find chick. Hey, save it for the track, son. Just get ready for what's coming. Yeah, yeah, look, I'm okay now, Lightning. You got our stuff back, and, and Flo's been taking good care of me. So, come on. Let's just have a nice, relaxing ride out to the stadium. Hey, we could even sing together. June bugs on my radiator, mosquitoes on the windshield. Dun, 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 dun. This is it. This is for all the marbles. And don't let that stupid stuff with chicks screw up your head. Stay focused. You'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, okay. All right. Let's go win this thing. What's the matter, Thunder? Didn't expect to see me here? What? Miss the big race? You weren't thinking of pulling out, were you? Oh, you know what I'm talking about, Chick. No idea, actually. Just looking forward to a friendly race with my good pal, Lightning. That's all. It's all about sportsmanship, don't you think? Oh, hey, how you doing, guy? Didn't see you. Hey, best of luck to you. We're just moments away from the official announcement of tonight's winner, Lightning McQueen and Chick. Oh, listen to this. You got a lucky break and you know it. Hey, listen, Chick. Luck had nothing to do with it. I won fair and square. You know, if you're going to be a loser, why not be a graceful loser? See? Changing the subject. Changing the subject. Subject changer. He doesn't want to admit that he can't pull that off again. Hey, hey, hey. Hold on, fellas. He did win the race, and we have the tapes to prove it. I'll tell you what, Chick. I'll race you again. Oh, yeah? Okay, good. How about tomorrow night? How about right here? How about tomorrow night right here? This is incredible. Lightning versus Chick in an all-out grudge match. Actually, Daryl, I've got something better in mind. The Radiator Springs Grand Prix. Three races, one in each part of Ornament Valley, and ending with one last Piston Cup race. Can we do that? We can now. Unbelievable! This is going to be a week of racing like nobody's ever seen. Chick, do you accept Lightning's challenge? Yeah, of course I do. Hey, and all you be sure to tune in and watch me. Chickster, number 86-ster. Win the Piston Cup trophy. For real this time.
Hey, what's that red light flashing in there for? Uh, dude, you're live on camera. I'm on the TV? Woo-hoo-hoo! I gotta call the relative! Okay, lean back, son, so we can start this thing. No, sorry. Welcome to the charming little town of Radiator Springs. My hometown. For race number one of the first annual Radiator Springs Grand Prix. Expect some wide open. Off-road action today is the rivalry between Lightning McQueen and Chick really heats up. He's the ugly green car with the mustache, right? Hey! Who you calling ugly? Spit cup. And the cars are lining up at the starting line now. Boy, this here is gonna be some kind of fun. Okay, folks, let's go racing. Welcome to race number two of the Radiator Springs Grand Prix, and we're up here in beautiful Tailfin Pass. I don't know, Mater, it looks like some pretty tricky roads up here. What do you think? Listen, we ain't done had no one fall off these here roads in a long time. I think. You doing okay, Chick? Yeah, of course I am. Can't get, you know, phone reception up here, that's all. We're here at the start of race number three of the Radiator Springs Grand Prix with Vince, who came all the way out here from Queens? Is that right? Uh, yeah. Hi, Ma! And why Radiator Springs? Did you come all the way out here to race against Lightning McQueen? Uh, uh no. Uh, uh, we, we know that guy, but, you know, uh, actually, we came out to um, train with Chick, you know, yeah. Uh, we figured if he wants to be the best, you know, he, he's got to train with, like, a real professional racer, you know? S uh, someone who could win a lot. And, and, uh, uh, yeah. This is it, Mac. Uh, yeah. Hey, what's the matter? Ah, uh, you know, end of the season and all. I I'm just going to miss this, that's all. Ah, oh, come on, Mac. You know that a champion has to go back the following season to defend his trophy, right? You and I got plenty more road to travel, partner. <laughs> You be careful out there, son. Ah, come on, Doc. I'm a veteran of the road now. A seasoned traveler. You still don't have headlights. Mm, don't you worry, Doc. I'll take care of him. And if he gets stuck again? I'm not gonna get stuck. Well, if you do, you know I'll be there to help you out. Thanks, Mater. So, uh, where are we going, anyway? I don't know. Wherever the road takes us, I guess. It's a pretty big country. Ooh, I almost forgot. Did you pack your trophy? Nah. Where is it? <laughs> Don't worry. It's in a good place. <laughs> 